Welcome to Moodle 3.9, dedicated to educators everywhere who've been supporting learners online during this special time. This is very much a community-focused release, with new features and improvements requested by our users, funded by the Moodle Users Association, contributed by collaborative groups, and designed to encourage global sharing of educational resources. A new activity chooser makes it easy to locate activities and resources. Frequently used items can be starred and a recommended tab displays items highlighted by the administrator. H5P, introduced in Moodle 3.8, is now fully integrated into standard Moodle, meaning teachers can add H5P activities, connect them to the gradebook, and store and create content in a new searchable content bank in the navigation drawer. Thanks to the Moodle Users Association, filtering participants in courses is much more powerful. You can now combine different filter options and build filters with multiple conditions. A second Moodle Users Association project in collaboration with Moodle partner Catalyst allows administrators and those with the relevant capabilities easily to copy courses either from the course management screen or within a course. Safe Exam Browser is an open source browser which locks down quizzes when they need to be taken in strict exam conditions by turning the computer into a secure workstation. Safe Exam Browser can be enabled in all quizzes in Moodle 3.9 thanks to the collaborative efforts of eight universities in Austria, Germany and Switzerland, along with Moodle partner Catalyst and our own HQ developers. Moodle 3.9 also sees a big focus on accessibility improvements. Moodle HQ has worked hard to improve accessibility on key Moodle pages following an external audit. And thanks to a collaboration with Brickfield Education Labs, we're introducing a number of improvements to the Atto text editor to make it easier to create accessible content in Moodle. Thank you to our HQ team, Moodle partners and community developers worldwide who have helped with the release of Moodle 3.9. And special thanks to all educators everywhere. <laughs>